Hello everyone. Welcome uh, to Simple Math for You. And today's lesson is writing equations in slope intercept form. أهلا بكم في Simple Math for You. ودرسنا اليوم هو كتابة المعادلات بدلالة الميل ومقطع Y. Part 1. الجزء الأول. Slope intercept form. What is slope intercept form? ما هي صيغة المعادلة بدلالة الميل والمقطع Y equals to M. X plus B. M is the slope, هو الميل. B is the Y intercept. Let's remember what is Y intercept. If you have any graph of a line, let's say that this is your line. This line cuts Y axis, let's say that this is 2, and cuts X axis at minus 3. It crosses, تعبر, وتقطع المحور X والمحور Y. محور X at minus 3. So this is called X intercept. And usually at X intercept Y 0. And this 2 is called Y intercept. مقطع Y. And usually مقطع Y when X is 0. So usually this is the point 0, 2. Represent the y intercept, maqta y, and this one minus 3, 0 represent the point where the line crosses the x axis, which is x intercept. In this equation, we are not using x intercept, ma nastakdim x intercept, bas rah nastakdim y intercept. So b represent the y intercept. Let's practice here and solve some exercises related to the slope intercept form. Write the equation of each of the following lines. Each line has separate case. كل line لوحده. The line the first passes through the point two and negative four and have a slope one over two. So if you write the equation in slope intercept form, we need the slope which is there, and we need the y intercept which is not there. Y intercept مش موجود. ما قليا. So what to do? I will use this point as X and Y. So this is your X and this is your Y. You find the B. So I will replace this is minus 4 equals 1 over 2. Replace the X by 2 plus B. Let's evaluate. Minus 4 is equal to half times 2, 1 plus B. Take the 1 to the other side. It will be minus 1. Or you can say minus 1, minus 1 if you like it. This way. So B is minus 5. Your B, yani Y intercept is minus 5. And then you need to write the equation. Y equals to. Now what? The slope in the conus of X plus the B, which is minus 5. This is the equation that we are looking for. Question 2. Write the equation of the line passes through the pair of points. We don't have now the slope given directly. So we will apply the formula. Remember. You can name this x1, y1. This is x2 and this is y2. And we will replace. 5 minus 5 over minus 1 minus 2. 0 over minus 3 is 0. Can we expect that before we do that? Yes, we can. We have noticed that this y coordinate is 5 and this y coordinate is 5. Let name ilhum nafs y coordinate. That means they are both in the same level of y. Yani it is a horizontal line, ufuqi, line ufuqi, ubimur ala 5. Yani it is something like this. So it's a horizontal line. That's why the slope is zero. And when the slope is zero and you want to apply y equals mx plus b, m is zero, slope is zero. So this will be y equals to b. Now, where is y? y here, if you replace, is the same as five. Here y five and here y five. So from the beginning, if you have equation to be written, both points have the same y, Without doing all this procedure, مباشرةً, we can write y equals to 5. Because this will be your y-intercept, actually. 
is this is five where the line cuts the y axis. So directly, simply y equals to five. Great. Question three, the line passes through the pair of points negative 2 and 5, minus 1 and 4. So we will find the slope, and it is very clear here that slope has a value, certain value, not 0, nor undefined. So we will apply the formula. Remember, we are taking with the signs. So this is minus 1 over minus 1 plus 2, which is one, so it is negative one. And we will apply y equals mx plus b. Replace this m by minus one. x plus b. We will choose one of the points. This is x. We will choose one of the points. You can choose the first one or the second one. I'm going to choose the first one. So I am choosing now minus 2 and 5. So this will be my x. This is my y just to find the b. And if you replace now, 5 is equal minus 1 times minus 2 plus b. So 5 is 2 plus b. Take this to other side. So b is 5 minus 2, which is 3. Since b is the 3, so y equals 2. Now we are done. Slope, we have it, minus 1 x plus the b3. Usually we don't write minus 1x, we write it minus x plus 3. And that's all. Now we have to write the equation passing through two points, and it is very clear here that the x coordinate is the same. When x coordinate is the same and both have x equals to minus 1, that means it's a vertical line. الاثنين لهم نفس x معناها هذا رأسي يمر بال minus 1. And that means this is a vertical line with undefined slope. So you cannot use the slope intercept form. Simply and directly, مباشرة x equals minus 1. That's it. Now we have two points. We can apply y equals mx plus b by finding the slope. The slope is x1, y1, x2, y2, 11 minus 5 over minus 3 minus 0. So it is 6 over minus 3, which is minus 2. Now to solve for y, we will replace now with mx. This is negative 2, plus the b. Either you use one of the points to replace, or simply you have here 0, 5. 0, 5 means what? If x is 0, y is 5. That means my y-intercept is 5 directly, without going through the procedure. بدون ما أعود أخذ point وأحط بدل y و x, I can't find directly the b. So, we end up with minus 2x plus 5. Done. And now, finally, we have a graph. And everything is given in this graph. Find the slope of the, uh, the I mean, the equation of the line that have the graph below. Now, also y equals mx plus b. Do we have the slope? Yes, we have it, minus 2. What if we don't have it? If you don't have it, then take two points and evaluate the slope using rise over run. So, for example, you can take this point and this point. And this has from left to right, nazil, slope nazil, negative. So it's negative. You can say rise is two, run is one. So it is minus two over one. Rise over run. You can say minus 2 over 1, so it is minus 2. Or you can say directly it is 2 and it is negative, so negative 2, which is the same value that he has mentioned here. Type. What is B? Also, no need to replace here X and here Y. B is very clear here that it is negative 2. By chance, it's the same as the slope. So Y is negative 2X minus 2. If 
B was not clear, for example, the line was crossing somewhere we are not sure about, then use the point. You can say that you can another alternative solution. Use two equals minus two and minus two. We are using the point minus two two given minus two two plus the B. We are replacing here. So two is four plus B. Take the four there. 2 minus 4 is B, so B is minus 2, which is exactly the value that we found directly. So if you have something seen, جاهز, وتقدر تطلعه من الشكل, yes, قم بذلك فورا, and find the equation. And that's all for the slope-intercept form. I hope it was an easy lesson. Thank you. See you in the next part.